to double check that everything's running nicely. Get to the edit. Post. Good. Alright. Be getting started in just a minute. I'm a little early today. making working okay Okay. Everything looking good. Gonna switch over. Good. Alrighty. Welcome, welcome. I don't think it's anybody's watching, but we'll just play like it is. Alright, so this is a show. Uh filmed this back in January. This is Toronto Canon. Um and yeah, it's about the next one on my list to edit, so I'll do it. Um, I'm not sure if my stretch disc. No, it's set properly. Cash. Yeah, okay. Okay. Good. I get. Uh, oh, yeah. I go. Hey. Yeah. I go. Okay. <laughs> that evil squeal. All right. Let's see. Hold on. Big round of applause. Toronto Cannon. <laughs> I got a couple of stories to tell you. A little song called Stop Me When I'm Lying. Check it out. I'm gonna need to go wired head, uh, wired head. Bluetooth is. Um, let's see. Again. All right, you yeah, have to bear with me for. Okay, hear myself now, and then I. Switch information to 
Audio. Off. Great. Okay, so now I gotta switch it in. Should be just the fault. It's not. Open. Hmm. Does that show up? No. Now I can't hear it. What the fuck? Wait. What? Why is it? Hmm. All right, hold up. I think I gotta restart for me. Save. Close. Open it again. Get some more water. On the good side, on the bright side, I have very, I have zero dot frames currently, which is a good sign. It means my internet can keep up with the piddly Half a megabit upload speed. All right, can I get that now? I can. Uh, did that show up? It did not. Why not? Joys of trying to f this shit around. Set you to codec. All right, that works. Check, check. All right, looks, looks good. Come on. Check it out. Here's voice. Is that the mix? Why does that not sound right to me? I'm very confused to why that doesn't sound correct. Oh, do I not? I know why. Uh, I got it. Timeline, I'm a dumb. <laughs> yeah, wow. That actually sounded pretty damn good for the live mix. Okay, so I actually have to. Oop. Uh, damn, that was a room mic. That sounded really fucking good for a room mic. Holy crap. Let's uh, save. Oh, shit. No. Hope this doesn't take long. So, yeah, that whole thing I was editing, uh, that was just one of the camera microphones. Big round of applause. Toronto Cannon! That sounds way better. Yeah, it's you? night and day. We're gonna go down to New Orleans if you don't mind. Alright, I do have to your audio. Why is it not giving me the option now? Oh, okay. I can let it do this thing. Oh boy.
See how the stream looks. Hey, look, not a whole not anything happening. Know if I can hear it. Check. Hello. Is there just like a really bad delay? I think Facebook has a long. That's the issue. See how the stream looks. Oh yeah. There. Hey, look. Not a whole not. Oh. I know why. Turn off my game. I yeah. I mean, well, yeah, I appear, of course, because, yeah, I'm constantly talking. Anything happening? I mean, well, yeah, I appear, of course, because, yeah, I'm constantly talking. Okay, well, I don't need that open. Um... Looks like we're running smooth. <laughs> Looks like we're running smooth. <laughs> Looks like we're running smooth. Okay, let me stop this for a minute. Halfway there. time. <clears throat> Almost done. I really wish I would have figured this part out like 10 minutes ago, 15 minutes ago, 20, yeah. 
before I streamed. Just doing this on stream is really boring. Super boring. My face is dry. <sighs> okay, come on, fifty two, fifty one. 52, 51, 50, 49, 50, 40, 50, 49, 48, 49, 40, 49, 47, 40, 40, okay, I'm gonna, hey, uh, that, that free space thing's going down, I should probably do something about that, um, yeah, it's gonna run out of space pretty soon, Actually, no, I don't need this. I'll keep that because that's only like a gig. I can delete this folder. Because I know I have it elsewhere. There. Now it's up to 86 gigs. Chugga, 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 so I just ordered a what is known as the Black Magic ATEM Mini. And that is this. I ordered one of these. And it's beautiful. And I can't wait to get it, but it says it's expected availability end of April. So I ordered it now so that when it's available it'll ship it to me right away and I don't have to wait. Even though I've been waiting all month to order it. Hey, look at that. It rendered. Okay, cool. So now we can stop. Let's go ahead and zoom out. Uh oh. Did I seriously only... I started editing the second set. Okay. So this is going to be a little weird. I'm going to jump back to the first set. And we're going to try this now. Okay. Get my thing set up. Looks good, looks good, looks good. Okay, let's try this again. All right, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Blue Stage. South Central Michigan's home of the Blues and Original Music Showcase. Got some real treats for you here tonight. And uh, all through the month of, uh, as we end up January, we got three shows in February. One's gonna be a Sunday matinee introducing a new band to the area. The name of that band is The Blues House, and they will be here on the 16th, so Sunday after you sober up, get in and out of church, come on down. It's going to be a 4 <laughs> o'clock show, and uh, Albion Slim's going to open that with his uh, new program of, of acoustic blues, acoustic electric blues in a solo format, um, so that's going to be a lot of fun. Um, next, uh, see, I think it's Saturday, February 8th, Nick Mark. Okay, I'm gonna skip through all this. Where's the music? Music probably starts right about. Yeah. From From uh, the world traveler here, I'd like you to please give up a large, loving round of applause for the Toronzo Cannon and his band. Yeah. Yeah. Right on, Keith. Thank you very much. Yeah, that sounds way better than the room mic. Yeah. We're gonna get. We're gonna give y'all what we got, is that all right? Dig this, we're gonna do a little something like this. We're gonna get our fingers warm.
now we're grooving. This kid, this kid right here, oh, he is one hell of a keyboard and uh, just piano player. Like, oh, he was amazing. I think the bass player was really good too. I don't know, it's been a few months since I remember looking at this video, so I can't particularly remember.
kid is insane and I love it. You can see, you can see the drummer camera is slowly tilting back. <laughs> oh, it was so frustrating because the camera did. Oh, I love it. I'm a, I'm a. I don't remember how many songs in I actually caught that the camera was down and like went and fixed it. But I do remember um, the band was like super professional about it. Like they just let me come right up, fix it. And then I got out of the way and they, they didn't even, they weren't even playing. I did it between songs. Um, I mean, we'll, we'll see it when we get to that part. But yeah, it was, uh, it was nice. I can feel it in the touch, y'all. You know she So I don't think I caught it until the next song. I don't. Uh, I don't recall. I mean, there's a pretty big break here. No, let's actually just go ahead and skip forward. I think. Okay, actually, yeah, it must have either fixed it here or fixed it there. Catch up. Sweet. Look at that. I only I only missed it for like one and a half songs. Okay, cool. Yeah, but they were like super professional about it, and I, uh, I was super happy because like they just let me come up, fix the camera, and then leave. It was nice. He found it again, so he's happy again. So one more time for Adam. <laughs> but this song is called Get Together, Get the Pod, or something like this. Get together, get a pod, baby. I'll get it in the text.
just this shot right here, I'm like, okay, the drummer's fucking insane too. The whole band's insane. When you can't be eye you tell the truth you tie the line. feelings are never told. I love the, uh, the lighting here too. It's like, well, without the color correction, it's dark, but I mean, that can easily be brightened up, but still. Off your shoulders, I'm turning cold. Sorry, I just had a thought. I'm like, what shows have I not added them? Let me check my spreadsheet. Um, boom. Blue stage, center cam videos. Nope, that's the invoice template. Uh, center cam. It should be up to date. Okay, so I've done everything. Haven't done that one. Haven't done that one. Little Lead Blues Imperials. That one's done, but I haven't gotten a set list. That one's done, that one's done. So, currently I have James Armstrong, which I don't have a set list for. Toronzo Cannon, which I do. Nick Moss, which I do. Jeremiah Johnson's done, currently uploading. Should change that. So interesting thing I'm I'm like observing. This is kind of just for me. So uh, the plan is to eventually be able to live stream this many cameras. However, in the coming months, I'll only be able to do up to four cameras. Um, and the four I'm considering is going to be the left operated camera, right operated camera, center cam, and then maybe a drum cam. This one's currently it fell down so it's fine um however i find i'm mostly sticking to this operated camera now that that's only specifically for this band it's going to be different for each band so really it's going to come down to maybe me talking with the band or me listening to them when they're sound checking to figure out where to best place my four cameras because the thing is, I know I want at least two operated cameras. That looks really nice. Having a center cam always to cut to in case something is wrong or in between songs. So they, they always start and end on. However, typically, like a drummer cam would be nice. But considering I don't have one right now, it's I'm making do without it. But it really depends. Like if there's a soloist or somebody who's always doing something intricate and interesting... 
I guess I would primarily. Uh, I don't know if I if I only have four cameras to choose from, I, I I have to be a little bit more choosy. I have to be very careful with where I place them. But yeah, currently these four cameras would probably be what I do if I was live streaming a band like Toronto Cannon. But I only know this because of hindsight and because I filmed it and now I'm editing it and I'm not really using these two cameras. This one I'm not using because it there's nothing. This one I'm not really using because uh, the music stand the bass player is using primarily is blocking him. If I was able to get the camera a little higher, which I probably did during the second set. I don't know. Let's actually go check that. I move the camera in the second set. I did, yeah. So second set, yeah, I moved the camera up. So yeah, during the second set, I'll be able to use that camera a little bit more. But in the first set, it's pretty much useless. But that's why six is a really good number. Because, like, you can get away with three. You can get away with four and five. Because you can get away with three. But honestly, three is, like, the minimum anything more than that and you're it's just gonna get sweeter and sweeter <sighs> oh man <sighs> oh boy okay Excuse me. tell you my neck's been sore past few nights i don't know what it is whether i've been sleeping weird or what but yeah it's just been kind of sore I'm not going to do that then. Oh. Sorry, I'm, I get a little stir crazy when I sit here and do this for too long. I've been going for maybe a half hour, 40 minutes. Yeah. <sighs> okay, let's continue.
just love the energy that this band has. Keyboard solo! I love it so much. Like, look at this guy go. like song number three and they're just going ham and I love it all right and this is I think where I noticed that the this is where I noticed that the the drum camera is down so I think I go and fix it from a real perspective you know holy shit says three viewers on Facebook hi guys welcome to the party So yeah, here's, you can see me walking around, I'm checking the cameras and everything, making sure everything's going. Because in the past, we've had issues with cameras just stopping, and I wasn't able to, basically, if the camera, oh look, okay, yeah, so I'm checking this camera. I'm going to slow this down, because uh, like I said, I'm 51, I ain't be jumping around up here all night. Oh, look at that. I adjust the camera now. Look at that. Past self, look it out for future self. High five. Let me slow this down a little bit. Let's song call. What did you tell him about me? Blues man's taking responsibility. Ain't that a switch? And I'm like, don't tell him. I'm your cousin. I meet you around the corner. <laughs> Something like this, y'all. Some of y'all might be experiencing this tonight. When you tell him about me, goes a little something like this. Take out the words. Look at that, Chris. My brother is operating this camera. He just frames it up, so you don't even see me. Look at that. You barely even noticed that I was there the entire time. Let's see, where am I actually going to start? Probably right here. Hey, you, like, I can just edit around me and I love it. That's the best. I'm a fucking invisible and I love it.
You said you wasn't happy. All he do is get drunk and fight. I can't show my love for you. We have to keep it out of sight. You told me to be still. I love these soft, quiet songs. Ah, oh, fuck. Keyboard. Be still. Be still. Then our day will come. I hang on to your words, baby. It's just when it's like this, I just love to turn it up. But I'm tired of sneaking around. I can't hold your hand when we go downtown. I'm tired of the secrecy. Oh, that's actually TEC's Leslie. That's great. When would you tell them about me, baby? <laughs> oh, man, I love it.
damn, this is great. It's like, drummer, you gotta give me a chance to cut to you. Won't you tell them about me, baby? Please tell them about me, yeah. I'm glad I'm sweating so y'all don't see my tears. <laughs> Tired of cheating. God, I love the keyboard player. Oh my god. Ain't that something for a blues man to say? I'm tired of sneaking. I'm tired of you going out with your friends, baby, and I gotta watch your your two kids. Y'all laughing, but that's gonna happen to me next week. <laughs> Met this woman, she's like, oh, well, you know, and we living together and stuff, and the next thing you know, she's like, I'm going to Florida to meet my sister. Could you watch my kids? I said, I wasn't planning to. I plan on being in the blues club when you live. When you <laughs> what? You can't believe I'm telling the truth? <laughs> <laughs> I'm here to tell the truth. That's the blues, right, y'all? Oh my god, I love it so much. Yeah. I'm gonna watch the kids. I'm gonna give them some NyQuil. <laughs> so they can go to sleep. And I told Pookie and Adam and, and Marvin, I'll meet you at the blues club, man. Hold on. I'm joking about that part. <laughs> Maybe. Please tell them about me. I love it when they play like super quiet, it's the best. great that's the blue I'm so glad he finally got me the set list because I've been waiting to edit this one okay uh, I'm gonna take a short bathroom break uh, I'm just gonna play back what I've already edited so yeah go, go ahead and follow, follow that baby from uh, the world traveler here I'd like you to please give up a large, loving round of applause for the Toronzo Cannon and his band. Yeah. Yeah. Right on, Keith. Thank you very much. Thank y'all for having me back, y'all. Yeah. We're gonna give, we gonna give y'all what we got. Is that all right? Yeah. Dig this. We're gonna do a little something like this. We're gonna get our fingers warm. <laughs>
Wonderful. Okay. That's the blues. So when I wrote this song, I'm like, I think everybody know about this song. The song called Insurance. Goes a little something like this. Rather lonely song, but check it out. My doctor said I'm going. phone ringing I don't know that number <clears throat> all right I gotta turn that off you're not supposed to ring Yeah. 
somewhere to feed. Damn. Insurance, all that for nothing. Insurance. Insurance. Cause I'm too young to die. Oh, I got my good talk. Again, doctor, well, just give me three aspirin, I'll break them up, and it'll last me three days, I guess. You know. Insurance, a cat scan, all I can afford is a kitten scan. Insurance, okay, okay, doctor, okay, I need 12 stitches, but all I can afford is seven. So wait a minute, if, just make the stitches longer. Just, you know, my mama said when you sew the, the seam, you just make the stitches. You don't do that, doctor? Okay, sorry. Well, if I clean the blood off the flow, could you give me a discount, maybe? And sure, just give me a tourniquet and I'll put it around my neck. How about that, all right? I won't feel nothing then, yeah. Oh, mm, and sure. Excuse me. Um, here, I'm gonna rewind. I gotta look something up. Bruce man's taking responsibility. Ain't that a switch? And I'm like, don't you? I'm your cousin. I meet you around the corner. With something like this, y'all. Some of y'all might be experiencing this tonight. When you tell him about. Go a little something like this, take out the words. Playing back so stuttery. Play back. You said you wasn't happy. All 
all he do is get drunk and fight. I can't show my love for you. We have to keep it out of sight. You told me to be still. Then our day will come. I hang on to your words, baby, that we'll become one. But I'm tired of sneaking around. I can't hold your hand when we go downtown. See, I'm tired of the secrecy. When would you tell them about me, baby? You said you'd leave them. And I believed every lie. Okay, so I am halfway... Halfway through the first but set. I can't say goodbye. You said, what about my kids? How many kids you got, baby? What are we gonna do? He makes all the money in the house. Now you have to. We'll just bring two kids, baby, but they good. I'm tired of sneaking around, baby. I can't hold your hand when we go downtown. See, I'm tired of the secrecy. When would you tell them about me, baby? Please. 
tell them about me, yeah. I'm glad I'm sweating so y'all don't see my tears. <laughs> I'm tired of cheating. Ain't that something for a blues man to say? I'm tired of sneaking. I'm tired of you going out with your friends, baby, and I gotta watch your, your two kids. Y'all laughing, but that's gonna happen to me next week. Met this woman, she's like, oh, well, you know, and we living together and stuff, and next thing you know, she's like, I'm going to Florida to meet my sister. Could you watch my kids? I said, I wasn't planning to. I was planning on being in the blues club when you lived, when you left. <laughs> what? You can't believe I'm telling the truth? <laughs> <laughs> but I'm here to tell the truth. That's the blues, right, y'all? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm going to watch the kids. I'm gonna give them some NyQuil so they can go to sleep. And I told Pookie and Adam and, and Marvin, I'll meet you at the Blues Club, man. Hold on. Okay, Pookie, Adam, and Marvin. So Pookie. Okay, Pookie is the drummer. Pookie. Adam is the keyboardist. And Marvin? I'm gonna watch the kids. I'm gonna give them some NyQuil so they can go to sleep. And I told Pookie and Adam and okay, and Marvin, I'll meet you. At the uh, Pookie, Adam, and Marvin. Blues Club, man. Hold on. <laughs> Pookie, Adam, Marvin, Taranzo. Uh, I just want to make sure. All right, so I just messaged Toronto on uh, Instagram. Um, he seems the most active there, and I actually I've gotten a response from him through there. So, okay, so I will wait. I mean, I'm not gonna wait. I'm just gonna continue editing, and then when he gets it to me, he gets it to me. It's gonna be probably not till the end of the week that these are finished. Uh, ouch. Okay. Anyway, let's finish the song. I'm joking about that part. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe he's joking. Please tell him about me. Look at that, he's got a Wikipedia. Okay, yeah, so, uh, yeah. Current band members, Tronzo Cannon, Adam Pryor, which is the keyboardist, uh, Marvin Little, which is bass guitar, and Melvin... Pookie sticks. All right, I'm just gonna copy this. In front of that wiki. Uh, let's go open that file. That one. 
Okay, Toronzo Cannon. So from left to right is. Adam Pryor, which I'm just going to say keys. Keys. Vocals and guitar. Pookie sticks. Lucy's Pookie sticks, Carlisle. Drums. Alright, got it. All right, back to it, back to it. Oh, go back. Actually, I kind of want to look up the keyboardist. Adam Pryor. artist here uh, with my Hammond SK2 keyboard. I can see it's coming. Fun. Okay. Um, getting off track. Close to mine. I'm awfully close to your line. They're going nuts. I love it. Awesome. Yeah, it's cool. Interesting, he's on Reddit. Pop over there. Welcome to the stream. I'll be back to editing in just a minute. Actually, you know what? I can just let stuff play while I'm doing this. Enjoy the music. 
goes a little something like this. Rather lonely song, but check it out. Come on, play smooth. My doctor said I'm going down slow. Was telling me he don't know. I got a job, but I'm still the working pole. He gave me one little pill and said, go. Get some insurance. Get some insurance. Cause you too young to die I went to the office just to see To find some shirts to cover me Most prices I can't afford It made an atheist call on a loan Insurance I need some insurance Cause I'm too young to die I read the fine print signed on the line I hope I got enough to keep from dying After all the questions and the third degree It felt just like a colonoscopy Insurance, they was all in me y'all, you know how many times you on my social security number? Insurance. Cause I'm too young to die. Hey, to the bridge. I read in the paper the other day a man lost his spouse. She's pushing up days and now he can't pay the bill. And now he lost his house. Insurance. Oh, he needs a little bit more. Needs some insurance, yeah. Insurance. Cause I'm too young to die. Hey, uh, Adam, uh, how much that organ cost? Go get it, man.
much for a, a, a aspirin again, doctor? Well, just give me three aspirin, I'll break them up. And it'll last me three days, I guess. You know. Insurance. A CAT scan. All I could afford is a kitten scan. Insurance. Okay, okay, doctor, okay. I need 12 stitches, but all I could afford is seven. Insurance. So wait a minute. If, just make the stitches longer. Just, you know, my mama said when you sew the, the seam, you just make the stitches. You don't do that, doctor? Okay, sorry. Well, if I clean the blood off the flow, could you give me a discount, maybe? Insurance. Well, just give me a tourniquet and I'll put it around my neck. How about that, all right? I won't feel nothing then, yeah. Oh, mm, insurance. All right, I'm back. Yeah. Some of you men might feel the same Look at 
I'm excited because uh, I just bought the A10 Mini Pro. Uh, it's not going to show up for another couple weeks, but when it does eventually show up, I'll be able to do up to four cameras. Uh, and if I buy an A10 Mini live streaming, I'll be able to live stream up to four cameras. Uh, and if I buy a second A10 Mini, not the Pro version, I'll be able to do seven cameras. Three of them have a, a live preview, and then the other four would be a live preview in a single channel. Basically, I'd daze them, chain them together, but it, it would work. So, yeah, I love this band. <clears throat> Let's see. A bit of talking until we do the next one. Wait, is this whole thing just a quiet song? Is that it? That's Marvin Little on the bass, y'all, right there. Introduce the band before so so we can recognize them in the lineup just in case they leave y'all. That's Marvin Little on the bass, y'all, right there. Yeah. Young face Adam right there, young man, 21 years old. Not as in this country. He said to Green Bay, uh, Green Bay, Green Bay lost, so he's mad and sad at the same time. <laughs> it's all right. Oh, I'm sorry. It's hot. The, the microphone hot, and it was up. So, uh, yeah. So, I don't know what Green Bay maybe should pass the hat around or something. You know, maybe y'all get another quarterback or something. I don't know. I'm from Chicago, so I I don't buy my Bears hat until they start winning. You know, <laughs> save some money. You know, I say. Oh, I, I'm just be walking down the street. It's like, oh my God, the Bears won. I said, really? And I start running where everybody else is running. Okay, what 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 about a hat? I'm that kind of bear saying, you know what I mean? <laughs> and on the drums, they be doing, oh, okay, I'm sorry. Okay. On, the, on the drums, ex Chippendales dancer. Yeah. Yeah, I, you know, I don't discriminate my band, you know what I mean? If you, you a stripper, ex stripper, come on, you want to play the drums? Come on. I love this whole yeah, bit, it's amazing. His stage name was Chocolate Sheep. He lost his job and he's, and he's been playing drums ever since. Pookie sticks on the drums. Yeah. Yeah. 
And if, if it was a poll around here, he'll do something for y'all. I just love how it's like a comedy show in between the songs. Like, that's, oh, yeah. that's great. Whenever you see a dollar bill, he's somewhere, huh? I gotta be me. <laughs> Once again, y'all sorry, we said y'all. Well, I, you know, my name is Toronto Cannon. Thank y'all for coming out. Thank you. Those, those of you who have saw me before, thanks for giving me a second chance, you know, to get it right. Hey, Callie. Uh, I'm a bus driver for the city of Chicago, so that's, that's where I write most of my songs. 26 years I've been driving that damn bus. And uh, they say I can leave in June of this year, but I only be 52. I mean, I just wrote a song called Insurance, you know, so. I'm like, shit, I, everything's coming, coming down, but we'll see what happens, you know. But I wrote this song in response to all these blues men talking about how my woman left me. My woman ain't no good, she did this. I'm tired of hearing that shit. Cause sometimes it's the man's fault. Ain't that right, ladies? Oh, damn, okay, I'm gonna right. start no revolution up in here, Joan of Arc, all right? Be cool. Yeah. Right on, a brother behind you, I'm sure, he, as he's eating his chips, he's like, yeah, I'm just keep my mouth full, but I'm, I'm gonna eat some chips, so I won't have to say nothing in response. My man, see, he knows what's going on. He's like, I'm eating, I can't reply, I can't reply. So right on, but this song, I got a different kind of problem. My woman loved me too damn much. I can't even close the bathroom door. And some of you men know what I'm talking about. What are you doing? I'm on Facebook. <laughs> Who messaged you? Message. New York. Who messaged you? But I wrote this song in response to all the blues men that's talking shit about their woman, about how they ain't no good. I just, this is the way I feel. This is my song. I'm sticking about it. Go to something like this. <laughs> woman say come and get some of this blackberry pie she got that look on her face y'all in that twinkle in her eye my baby love me too much don't know the reason why she started acting this way about about the age of 45. Some of you ladies know what I'm talking about. Mm. Mm. I ain't, ain't that good looking, but uh, I guess I'm doing something right. Cause she wanna make love, y'all. Morning, noon, and night, my baby does love me too much. Don't know the reason why. She started acting all frisky. Meow, meow. About, about the age of 45. My woman talked too much. I know it's true. Cause she had told all her girlfriends and I gotta make love to them too. Cause I ain't no punk. <laughs> Just the, cause I ain't no punk. <laughs> Gotta make love to them too. Cause I ain't no. I gotta get the timing of this perfect. Cause I ain't no punk. Keep your business to yourself, ladies. <laughs> She loved me too much. 
don't know the reason why. She started out this way about the age of 45. She cocked one leg against the wall. She said, get off of me. I want your young keyboard player to finish me off. <laughs> Did y'all know about this? Did y'all know about this? Apparently, she don't love me that much. <laughs> I know, I know the reason why. We're gonna have a long talk. On. Apparently, she don't love me that much. <laughs> I know, I know the reason why. We're gonna have a long talk, home, brother. She started out this way. <laughs> About the age of 45. It got so freaky, y'all, you know, I put my legs on her shoulders. Yeah. She loved me too much. That hurt, too. I'm sorry for all the ladies that I encountered that. There's a reason why. She started acting this way, y'all. This song I almost finished, sorry. <laughs> About the age of 45. One day I'ma die, Lord, it's gonna be my time. But she's gonna be up there waiting for me, y'all, on cloud nine. That's the Rolling Stones song, man. Anyway, anyway. she loved me too much. <laughs> nine. That's the Rolling Stones song, man. Anyway, she loved me too much. <laughs> Don't know the reason why. Why is she naked on cloud now? She started out this way. About the age of 45. Oh, there she go, drinking a Red Bull with them pumps on again looking at me with a one good eye. <laughs> looking at me with a one good eye. Them pumps on again. Looking at me with a one good eye. I should hide right on the side of her so she can't see me. But she smell me. Damn. I'm gonna give her two minutes of my time, yeah. <laughs> Thank y'all. Thanks for listening to me. Hmm. I, that that was a little bit different, but yeah, still fun. <clears throat> now this next song is kind of freaky, y'all. It's about putting a spell on a woman, like a voodoo thing, you know, something I made up. But it, you know, it sounds like a spell. Or something. I think I know which one this is. Uh, documents, blue stage. So that was maybe yeah, Johnny the Conqueror route. Shoop. That's next. I made up, but it you know it sounded like a spell, so I'm like, oh. okay, cool. Let's see what happened. It's not gonna pass FDA anyway, so whatever they call. The song called John the Conqueror route. Sounds a little something like this. Hmm? this. I went to my grandma.
grandfather. This is a good song. How do you get grandmama to love you? He's from Jackson, Mississippi. He said, go upstairs and look in that box. I told you never to look in. Sound a little something like this.
Oh shit, that's a great part. I can't cut away from that. Hold on. Yeah, definitely gotta cut that first. Oh. Play smooth.
Thank you. <laughs> That was cool. I just realized I left my door open and I think my cat came in. Maybe, maybe not. Either way, I'm um, gonna take a restroom break, so. I'm gonna rewind and play a different song back. Try this one. So I'm about me. Go a little something like this, take out the words. Said you wasn't happy. All he do is get drunk and fight. I can't show my love for you. We have to keep it outside. You told me to be still. Then our day will come. I hang on to your words, baby. That we'll become one. But I'm tired of sneaking around. I can't hold your hand when we go downtown. I'm tired of the secrecy When would you tell them about me, baby? You said you'd leave them
Please tell them about me, yeah. I'm glad I'm sweating so y'all don't see my tears. <laughs> Tired of cheating. Ain't that something for a blues man to say? Tired of sneaking. I'm tired of you going out with your friends, baby, and I gotta watch your, your two kids. Y'all laughing, but that's gonna happen to me next week. Met this woman, she's like, oh, well, you know, and we living together and stuff, and next thing you know, she's like, I'm going to Florida to meet my sister. Could you watch my kids? I said, I wasn't planning to. I was planning on being in the blues club when you lived, when you left. What? You can't believe I'm telling the truth? <laughs> <laughs> but I'm here to tell the truth. That's the blues, right, y'all? Yeah. I'm gonna watch the kids. I'm gonna give them some NyQuil so they can go to sleep. And I told Pookie and Adam and, and Marvin, I'll meet you at the Blues Club, man, hold on. <laughs> I'm joking about that part. <laughs> Please tell them about me. Okay, next song. But one more time for the band that's kicking ass, y'all. They, they doing their thing. Marvin, Adam, Pookie. We're gonna slow down. We gonna slow down a little bit. I'm gonna do a little Albert King thing I used to do. I ain't did that in a long time. A little song, well, you know, as the years go passing by. But see, you know, if you don't look at the calendar all the way, them years will be gone. It's 2020, what? What happened to this? <clears throat> so we're gonna do the B minor this time. We used to do the B flat, but everybody got flat. I'm like, no, don't be flat. Don't be flaccid. I mean, flat. Look at him, 21 year old, not me. Like a superhero, get out of here, man. Yeah, I know, yeah, yeah, I know, yeah. <laughs> Think about Green Bay, that's how you get him. I just love how they keep ragging on him because he's the young one and he's from Wisconsin. <laughs> yeah, I know, yeah, yeah, I know, yeah. <laughs> Think about Green Bay. That's how you get him. All right, come on. I need smooth playback. And he said with hands on the hip. Green Bay, yeah. Oh. Gotcha. Okay, I'm sorry, y'all. Here we go. <laughs> Be mine. How long is this? Wait, where's my notepad? There it is. This is as the years go passing by. Did 
not mean to make that full full screen. As the years go passing by, okay. Come on. Computer. I know you can play it. Why is it so stuttery all of a sudden? Okay, I'm getting like 15 frames a second. What's going on? I'm going to restart Premiere because this is getting annoying. I hate this bug. There's this bug in Premiere that it's just all right. Hold on, I'm just gonna let's see. Let's take you know, copy. Premiere, I swear to fucking god. Wait, why do I have. Okay, I just need this one. Was that it? That's so dumb. Alright, whatever. I don't need to do that. That was a waste of time. Oh. Gosh. Okay, I'm sorry, y'all. Here we go. <laughs> Be mine. There's nothing I could do.
Fry, everybody. So long, goodbye, baby. Solid gold dancers, everybody. Right on. Awesome. Okay, one more song, and I'll be halfway through. Next, last one of this set is I've Been Better to You Than I've Been to Myself. Right there. Alright, so I think I'm going to finish up this song, and I think I'm going to call it a day after that. But, yeah, one more, and then thanks to whoever joined me. I wrote a song dedicated to Come on. a woman that used to let me buy her anything she wanted. And I was like, baby, you so nice. Thank you. That's the way it is. That's the way it is. Look at the ladies over there know what I'm talking about. <laughs> right on. It's come tax time. I need, your, I need your social security number, baby. You gonna get a... You gonna get a 1099 from me, mama. A little song like this. A little song called I've been better to you and I've been to myself. Yeah, based on a true story. Uh, yeah. Hold on, let me get the drums in there. Myself. Yeah, based on a true story.
in the weary land. I ain't your husband, baby. I'm just a boyfriend. I've been better to you than I've been to myself. Yes, you do. I pay your mortgage. I can't pay my rent. I can't find you, baby, with my money spent. On the day when I get paid, girl, see, you pick up your phone right away. Love is a gamble, and I lost. I can't blame nobody, baby. It's all my fault. I've been better than you I'm gonna bend to myself I'm the one I feel like I'm hanging on this camera a little too long I can't blame nobody, baby It's all my fault I've been better than you I'm gonna bend to myself Yes, you do. CDs for sale if you're interested. I'll be back there in the back over there selling them. Now they're going for 
$20, but I sold it to Buddy Guys for $19.98. I only went to one class of marketing, so I figured that's how you do it. I, just, I said, that's all I gotta do? See you later. But anyway, one more time, y'all, for the band, y'all. Adam Pry right there. Pookie Sticks on the drums. Marvin Little on that big bass. <laughs> <laughs> and my name is Toronto Cannon. We'll be back, y'all. Don't go nowhere. You know, brother TC come up and do his thing, y'all. That's a nice hat. Don't lay it down around me, brother. Don't lay that hat down around me. <laughs> right on. Right, break it down for them. Brother, you want to come on up here, brother? Are you good right there? Okay, cool. Yeah, I think it's there now. All right, so what do you think of the first half of the show? Is that all? Come on, chop the road here. Yeah, now we're talking. Come to Chicago, Toronto Kent and the band. Come take a short pause here. Let the boys uh, relieve themselves and get my cocktail. We're gonna, we're gonna do CDs at uh, up here, I'm going. Right over here at the usual merchandise area. Make sure you get an autographed CD by those guys. That's what keeps the gas in the truck, puts tires on us too. So we gotta support them on the road. And you get an autograph to go with it. So don't be shy, step right up there. Again, if you don't have your name on the email list, get it there. And if you'd like to pick up some tickets for the future shows, they're all here and there's a schedule over there. How about it doing? All right, thank you very much. Don't go away. Short pause and we'll be back with some more Toronto Cannon. Right on, y'all, yeah. Yay! I love that. I love that whole section where it's just like, okay, now the band's gonna vamp, somebody's gonna say announcements, and then the band just gonna come right back in and finish the song. Like, it's so pro. I love it. I just love how like they're just like another fucking level. It's amazing. All right, so I guess that's the first set done. Awesome. Um. Hmm. Should I keep going? I don't know. I got two viewers. Should I keep going or should I put, do the rest tomorrow? Let's put it to a vote. <laughs> a vote of like one person who's actually active in chat. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. What do you guys think? Should I keep going or should I do the rest tomorrow? Uh, for the record, I've been streaming for almost three hours now. That's not helpful. I'm not really tired. I'm just... Hmm. I mean, let's see. I'm halfway through. Let's see. I got... Let's see. I can just look at the list. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I got nine more songs. Yeah, I guess I'll take a break. Yeah, I'll I'll play the show from the beginning. I'm gonna take a break, do some other stuff, uh, and then I will come back and finish. That sounds like a good idea. I like getting it done in one session too. All right, so I will be back. You guys enjoy the music. Oh, follow that, baby. From uh. The World Traveler here. 
I'd like you to please give up a large, loving round of applause for the Toronzo Cannon and his band. Hit! Right on, Keith. Thank you very much. Thank y'all for having me back, y'all. We're going to give, give y'all what we got. Is that all right? Dig this. We're going to do a little something like this. We're going to get our fingers warm.
Sie Süppel. Right on. This song is, uh, well, like I, said, I like to dedicate my song, so this song is dedicated to everybody here tonight who's gonna be on their last date. Don't, you don't know it till you get home. <laughs> you know? So have fun now. This might be the last time you see him or her. You know? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> um, if I could say this, y'all, um, my new keyboard player right here, Young Adam, is uh, from Madison, Wisconsin. He ain't new no more. But, um, you know, this night is dedicated to you, man. Okay? He just lost a girlfriend a couple of weeks ago. When they were in the mall, and, and he lost her. And, and he, yeah, he was in the Mall of America somewhere, but he found her again, so he's happy again. So one more time for Adam, everybody. You got the blues. <laughs> but this song is called Get Together, Get the Pod. It's something like this. Get together or get a pod, baby. I'll get it in the text.
Yeah, I try to, I try to write from a real perspective, you know. you know. I don't know what it feels to be 21, but he does. Does it feel all right? Sometimes. <laughs> Fifty-one. That's me. So he, I'm sorry, y'all. Y'all know what I'm talking about. You got some fifty-one years out there tonight, right? Fifty-one, right? Yeah. 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 Dig that. All right, here we go. We're gonna slow this down, cause uh, like I said, I'm fifty-one. I ain't gonna be jumping around up here all night. I'm being fell out, my pants falling. Well, if my pants was tight this morning. Let me slow this down a little bit. A little song called, When Will You Tell Him About Me? Oh, yeah. Blues man's taking responsibility. Ain't that a switch? And I'm like, don't tell him about me. I'm your cousin. I meet you around the corner. A little something like this, y'all. Some of y'all might be experiencing this tonight. When will you tell him about me? Goes a little something like this. Say out the words. Said you wasn't happy. All he do is get drunk and fight. I can't show my love for you. We have to keep it out of sight. You told me to be still. That our day will come. I hang on to your words, baby. That we'll become one. But I'm tired of sneaking around. I can't hold your hand when we go downtown. I'm tired of the secrecy When would you tell them about me, baby? You said you'd leave them every lie It's been three long years baby But I can't say goodbye You said what about my kids How many kids you got baby What are we gonna do He makes all the money in the house. Now you have to. We'll just bring two kids, baby, but they good. I'm tired of sneaking around, baby. I can't hold your hand when we go downtown. See, I'm tired of the secrecy. When you tell them about me, baby. I'm 
Please tell them about me, yeah. I'm glad I'm sweating so y'all don't see my tears. <laughs> Tired of cheating. Ain't that something for a blues man to say? Tired of sneaking. I'm tired of you going out with your friends, baby, and I gotta watch your, your two kids. Y'all laughing, but that's gonna happen to me next week. Met this woman, she's like, oh, well, you know, and we living together and stuff, and next thing you know, she's like, I'm going to Florida to meet my sister. Could you watch my kids? I said, I wasn't planning to. I was planning on being in the blues club when you lived, when you left. <laughs> what? You can't believe I'm telling the truth? <laughs> <laughs> but I'm here to tell the truth. That's the blues, right, y'all? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna watch the kids. I'm gonna give them some NyQuil so they can go to sleep. And I told Pookie and Adam and, and Marvin, I'll meet you at the Blues Club, man, hold on. <laughs> I'm joking about that part. <laughs> Please tell them about me. That's the blue. <laughs> Who can say, you know you being recorded, right? <laughs> yeah, I mean. I know now. <laughs> uh -oh. It's cool though. I'm gonna we'll say, well, uh, hey. My number is on the website. Call me, I'll be at the crib next week looking at somebody's kids. Without the night quill. <laughs> Did good. <laughs> I write a song about it. If she leave, I write a song about it. But they good. <sighs> I'm left-handed. All right. This next song is uh dedicated to uh, you know, insurance. <laughs> We all need insurance. I like to write songs. There's maybe, you know, if only 10 people in the audience, maybe six people know what I was talking about. So when I wrote this song, I'm like, I think everybody know about this song. The song called Insurance. Goes a little something like this. Rather lonely song, check it out. My doctor said I'm going down slow Was telling me and he don't know I got a job but I'm still the working pole He gave me one little pill and said go Get some insurance Get some insurance Cause you too young to die I went to the office just to see To find some shirts to cover me Most prices I can't afford It made an atheist call on the Lord Insurance I need some insurance, yeah. 
Oscar P. Insurance, they was all in me, y'all, you know. Insurance, how many times you on my social security number? Insurance, cause I'm too young to die. Hey, to the bridge. again, doctor? Well, just give me three aspirin, I'll break them up. And it'll last me three days, I guess. You know. Insurance. A cat scan. All I can afford is a kitten scan. Insurance. Okay, okay, doctor, okay. I need 12 stitches, but all I can afford is seven. Insurance. So wait a minute, if, just make the stitches longer. Just, you know, my mama said when you sew the, the seam, you just make the stitches. You don't do that, doctor? Okay, sorry. Well, if I clean the blood off the flow, could you give me a discount, maybe? Insurance? Well, just give me a tourniquet and I'll put it around my neck. How about that, all right? I won't feel nothing then, yeah. Oh, mm, insurance. Yeah, that's the blues. 
And we're gonna get to some oldies for goodies that I wrote. I see a certain demographic in here. And I think I should cater to the crowd. There's a song I wrote for the men, as my granddad said, the men folk. A little song called Midlife Crisis. And I'm not judging, because I'm 50, I'll be 52 on February 14th. So I'm right there with you. I got my ARP card three years ago. They said, I don't know why they sent it to me. 48, 49. I'm like, okay, all right, I, I use it. But when we got to Florida, I was getting discounts on everything, wasn't I? That's right. I was like, man, get extra cheese on it, Adam. I, I buy the hamburger for you. Get extra cheese, man. We at Denny's. Man, come on, man. Get it. You want some coffee, Marvin? Get the coffee, man. I got the card, man. <laughs> I know. I was a king. I know. Well, I mean, well, with the ARP card, I was. But, you know. So this song is called Midlife Crisis. Some of y'all might recognize uh, <clears throat> some of the sword line. Something like this. Check it out.
my wife has got it too. We having a midlife crisis, y'all. A midlife crisis, yeah. I'm 50 thinking like I'm 22. A midlife crisis, hey. So I, I don't buy my bears hat until they start winning, you know. <laughs> Save some money, you know what I say? Oh, I, I'm just walking down the street. It's like, oh my God, the bears won. I said, really? And I start running where everybody else is running. Okay, what, what, what about a hat? I'm that kind of bear saying, you know what I mean? And on the drums, they be doing, oh, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> on, the, on the drums, ex Chippendales dancing. Yeah, yeah, I, you know, I don't discriminate my band, you know what I mean? If you, if you a stripper, ex stripper, come on, you know how to play the drums, come on. Yeah, his stage name was Chocolate Chic. <laughs> and he lost his job, and he's, and he's been playing drums ever since. Pookie Six on the drums, yeah. And if, if it was a poll around here, he'll do something for y'all, boy. The poll is too close to the wall. He don't want to hit his head. Yeah, oh, yeah, because yeah, whenever you see a dollar bill, he's somewhere high. I gotta be me. Once again, y'all sorry who we sit, y'all. Well, I, you know. My name is Toronzo Cannon. Thank y'all for coming out. Thank you. Those, those of you who have saw me before, thanks for giving me a second chance, you know, to get it right. Uh, I'm a bus driver for the city of Chicago, so that's, that's where I write most of my songs. 26 years I've been driving that damn bus. And uh, they say I can leave in June of this year, but I only be 52. And then I just wrote a song called Insurance, you know, so I'm like, shit, I said, everything's coming, coming down on me, but we'll see what happens, you know. But I wrote this song in response to all these blues men talking about how my woman left me. My woman ain't no good, she did this. I'm tired of hearing that shit. Because sometimes it's the man's fault. Ain't that right, ladies? Oh, damn. Okay, I'm right. I don't start no revolution up in here, Joan of Arcs, all right? Be cool. <laughs> yeah. Right on. A brother behind you, I'm sure, he, as he's eating his chips, he's like, yeah, I'm just keep my mouth full, because I'm 
I'm gonna eat some chips so I won't have to say nothing in response. My man said, you know what's going on. He like, I'm eating, I can't reply, I can't reply. So right on, but this song, I got a different kind of problem. My woman loved me too damn much. I can't even close the bathroom door. And some of you may know what I'm talking about. What are you doing? I'm on Facebook. Who messaged you? Message. New York. Who messaged you? But I wrote this song in response to all the blues men that's talking shit about their woman, about how they ain't no good. I just, this is the way I feel. This is my song. I'm speaking about it. Go a little something like this. woman say, come and get some of this blackberry pie. She got that look on her face, y'all, and that twinkle in her eye. My baby, love me too much. Don't know the reason why. She started acting this way about, about the age of 45. Ladies know what I'm talking about. I ain't that good looking, but uh, I guess I'm doing something right. Cause she wanna make love, y'all. Morning, noon, and night, my baby does love me too much. Don't know the reason why. She started acting all frisky. About, about the age of 45. My woman talk too much. I know it's true. Cause she told all her girlfriends and I gotta make love to them too. Cause I ain't no punk. Keep your business to yourself, ladies. <laughs> she loved me too much. <laughs> Don't know the reason why She started out this way About the age of 45 She cocked one leg Against the wall She said, get off of me I want your young keyboard player to finish me off Did y'all know about this? Did y'all know about this? Apparently she don't love me that much. <laughs> I know, I don't know the reason why. We're gonna have a long talk home, brother. She started out this way. <laughs> about the age of 45. It got so freaky, y'all. You know, I put my legs on her shoulders. Yeah. She loved me too much. That hurt, too. I'm sorry for all the ladies that encountered that. There's a reason why. She started acting this way, y'all. This song almost finished, sorry. <laughs> About the age of 45. One day I'ma die, Lord, it's gonna be my time. But she's gonna be up there waiting for me, y'all, on cloud nine. That's the Rolling Stones song, man. Anyway, she loved me too much. <laughs> Don't know the reason why. Why is she naked on cloud nine? She started out this way about 
the age of 45. Oh, there she go, drinking a Red Bull with them pumps on again. Looking at me with a one good eye. I should hide right on the side of her so she can't see me. But she smelled me. Damn. I'm gonna give her two minutes of my time. Yeah. yeah. Thank y'all. Thanks for listening to me. That's my woman, you know. It's, I try to write from a semi-real perspective, you know. But it's cool. Now this next song is kind of freaky, y'all. It's about putting a spell on a woman. Like a voodoo thing, you know, something I made up. But it, you know, it sounds like a spell. So I'm like, okay, cool. Let's see what happened. It's not gonna pass FDA anyway, so whatever they call it. This song called John the Conquer Root. It sounds a little something like this. <laughs> my grandfather. I said, how'd you get grandmama to love you? He's from Jackson, Mississippi. He said, go upstairs and look in that box. I told you never to look in. Sound looks something like this. I got it now.
93 days, I've been thinking about you. I'm beginning to wonder about my route. Open my door, we go outside. I see you standing there asking, can I come inside? song, I have to go to the hotel room and take a shower and pray. <laughs> or pray while I'm in the shower crying in the fetal position. Anyway. <laughs> it's cool. But one more time for the band that's kicking ass, y'all, because they, they do their thing. Marvin, Adam, Pookie. We gonna slow down a little bit. I'm gonna do a little Albert King thing I used to do. I ain't did that in a long time. A little song, well, you know, as the years go passing by. Cause you know, if you don't look at the calendar all the way, them years will be gone. Like, it's 2020. What? What happened to this? Yeah. So we're gonna do the B minor this time. We used to do the B flat, but everybody got flat. I'm like, no. Don't be flat. Don't be flaccid. I mean, flat. <laughs> Look at him, 21 year old. Not me. Like a superhero. Get out of here, man. Yeah, I know, yeah, yeah, I know, yeah. <laughs> Think about Green Bay. That's how you get him. And he said with hands on the hip. Green Bay, yeah. Oh. Gotcha. Okay, I'm sorry, y'all. Here we go. <laughs> Be mine. Thank you. 
There's nothing I could do. If you leave me here to cry, there's nothing I could do. Come on, bring it out. Bring it out, Adam. Bring it out.
Adam Pry, everybody. So long, goodbye, baby. For the solid gold dancers, everybody. Right on. Alrighty, I am back from my break. <clears throat> Look at that, I had one more song left I could have let played. Alrighty, so that was basically the entirety of the first set again. Set the last song. And now we're gonna finish the second set. Starting with, where is it? Starting with number eight. Stop me when I'm lying. Got a couple of stories to tell you. A little song called Stop Me When I'm Lying. Check it out. Ah, maybe I should set the resolution back to eight. Check it out. Okay, let's 
guitar. <laughs> a bad contract. Kevin. Next up, walk it off. Oh boy, we gotta do some blues. Oh man. Do the thing called walk it off. Sometimes you gotta. I don't know why the playback gets so stuttery all of a sudden. It's really strange. Uh, let's restart from here.
We gotta do some blues. Do the thing called walk it off. Blues. Do the thing called walk it off. Sometimes you gotta walk it off. Three D stories are true. Yeah, three D stories are true. That's right. Yeah. I'm gonna let you see. You guess which one? Something like this. Let's go on. and kind but now we don't know if the baby is his or mine oh, I gotta walk it. oh if the baby is his or mine oh, I gotta walk it on. baby is his or mine I don't know why this playback keeps getting so stuttery it's really annoying She said, see, he was an old friend, uh, and she lost her head. Now I know my woman is nice and kind, but now we don't know if the baby is his or mine. in the club, my girlfriend on the way, I'm standing here nervous on TC stage, she came right in and sat right down, wearing the same dress I bought them both when I was out of town.
Her husband get home at seven. I'm gone by six. I get to my house and open my door. There he is with my woman on my living room floor. I gotta walk it off. And a dog didn't even bite him on the ass. Have mercy. I gotta walk it off. You've been there before. Pulled a knife, he pulled a gun, and looked at me like I should run. I pulled my hand grenade, shook it in his face, and pulled a pin, cause that's the Chicago way. Damn. <laughs> run. I pulled my hand grenade, shook it in his face, and pulled a pin, cause that's the Chicago way.
Now I'm going to take you back to a time where... I don't know why the playback is so bad. The 70s, because I see my demographic out here. I see the demographic. Again, I see. When I play this, the first part of the song, y'all gonna say, ooh, because it's gonna take you back to a time where everybody was cool. And the shoes was this high. Really? Yeah, he don't know nothing about that. The shoes was this high, the hair was this big. Yeah, yeah. He don't see it on uh, the news. He had long hair. Anyway, okay. The preacher, the politician, and the pimp. Check this out, y'all. <laughs> Ooh, I love this one. Check this out, y'all. Okay, come on. The preacher, the politician, and the Come on. Catch up. Check this out, y'all. Come on. Play it.
All right, fine seasoned woman. Ordinary woman. Chopped arm off and I count the rings inside of her. I said, she is 50. Uh, can you sew this on before? That's how you know how old the tree is. Just, you know, for him, he don't know what's going on. Oh yeah, I'm sorry, that song is not supposed to be that long. Fine seasoned woman, y'all, a little something like this.
Like a woman about my age Couple of wrinkles and a little gray I got it too, baby, don't worry Do things you like and some things she don't know She let you do this, but that she won't Oh, a fine season woman so off it's because it's so stuttery it's really annoying come on just play
I wrote this song on my first CD from Alligator called Fine Season Woman. Now, I got another song on my new CD called Ordinary Woman. You know, for those who bought both CDs, and thank you for everybody for buying the CDs. But that Ordinary Woman is kind of like a, an answer to the Fine Season Woman. So I'm like, give me an ordinary woman. Give me, babe, an ordinary girl. Say it again, Lord. Give me an ordinary woman. Give me, babe, an ordinary girl. Check this out. A five foot four from her head to the ground. Just about a 155 pounds. Pretty face, but she missing two teeth. But they on the back, that's all right with me. I said, give me an ordinary woman. Give me, babe, an ordinary girl. Check it out. A fine season woman, she pay her own bills. She keep me around for her thrills. Fine season woman, a silver fox. She don't mind making love in her socks. I said, give me. You know, the big tube socks from the 70s, they were red and red and blue, you know? Give me, baby. Everybody was looking like Dr. J when they wore them socks. Go to me, girl. Sorry, I'm just, let, 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 let it marinate, let it marinate just a little bit. Keep that groove right there. Y'all feeling good, is it all right? Yeah. We just grooving. See, we let it marinate, see. I didn't know what marinate meant. I thought that's when the butterflies go south. But I looked on the internet. It said, in a, it said in a, the internet told me this. It said, marinate means let the meat sit in the juice all night long. I said, I did that before, didn't even know it. Let the meat sit in the juice all night long. See, I was looking at the, the late show when I fell asleep and there was a hot dog I left on the stove. I don't know what y'all thinking about. Y'all laughing, mm -hmm, eat the juice, mm -hmm. I look, at, look at her, you laugh a little bit too hard there, hold on now. But that's what it means, marinate, let the meat sit in the juice all night long. Oh, somebody said, yeah, right on. I think she's thinking about something else. Oh, it's all right. We grown in here. That's what my granddad say. We grown. We grown. Well, you just got grown, but it's cool. Give me. You can stick around. An ordinary woman. I know you're going to learn something tonight. You too. Give me, babe. An ordinary girl. Break it down some more. Don't like it. I, I don't like to, you know, women to keep, uh, you know, I don't mind a woman with a run in a stocking. It's all right. Just don't wear it two days in a row. Because I'm like, that run was there. That run was there. You, I know you, I saw you put fingernail polish on it, so the run won't go no, 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 no longer. See, I know the little tricks, lady. I read y'all books. Little female books, you know. Matt, not Mademoiselle, that's the young book. What's the book for the ladies? You know, anyway, Woman's Garden. Not Woman's Garden, what the? Today's woman. Ah, anyway, you know what I'm talking about. One of the women, but I'll be sitting in the office, the dentist's office, and look, I'm like, mm, let me see what they talking about. So that's how they keep it run from their stock, and they put, they put uh, lipstick, uh, not lipstick, they put uh, fingernail polish on it, so it won't run. Yeah, anyway, you know what I'm about that. And back when I was growing up, some of y'all might know, because I see my demographic. I never knew what that hot water bottle was on the back of the, the, the bathroom door. I never knew what it was until I got a little older. I was like, oh, no, I did not know. He, I know he don't know what we're talking about. You see how much these people laugh and they know exactly what I'm talking about. How does it feel to be out of the loop, brother? After the show, somebody tell me what I'm talking about because I'm not, I'm not going there with you, brother, but I, it was just a big hot water bottle with a yellow cord hanging out of it. I thought it was scuba diving equipment. I didn't know what was going on. But you never heard this before? No, okay. You seen a hot water bottle before? Yeah, hot. 
Smell like vinegar. Oh, what's going on up in here? Mama cooking way in the, cause my, the kitchen was way, we had a long hallway when I was a kid. And the, the kitchen was way down there. And I'm like, why it smell like vinegar in here? Mama cooking sauerkraut in the kitchen. Okay, I'm sorry. What, man? This is the blues, man. I'm trying to, I'm, I'm letting them know I'm real. I said I'll be 52, I know a little something. I'm going to tell you about what the hot water is. Let me get back to the ordinary woman, because I don't mind that. Give me, I can't believe I said all of that. An ordinary woman. Just edit all that out, brother. It's cool. Give me, babe. <laughs> That's the part I fucking lost my shit. It's just like, I just edited all that shit out. And I'm just like, I can't. It's in the middle of the song. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> No. <laughs> ah, I love it. Oh, man. All right. Uh, that's decided I need to get a wrist pillow for my keyboard. Edit it out, he says. Alright. Um, let's see. Been going for almost five hours. Yeah, I think I'm gonna call it there. Um Yeah. One, two, three, four. I've got four more songs. Alright, uh yeah, I think I'm gonna end the stream. I'm getting a little burnt. I will finish this up either tomorrow or another day later on. Yeah, you know, I think I'll probably do it tomorrow. Finish the editing tomorrow, maybe do the color correction, and then maybe titles. I think I'll do titles later. Um, but yeah, thank you for joining me. Uh, I want to keep doing this. Let's see, how many more shows do I have to edit? Let me see. Check, check, check. Oops, wrong one. Let's see. We got... We got... Alright, Toronzo Cannon. That's this one. Nick Moss Band. That'll be next. I think another Lady in the Tramps. And then potentially Blue Tuesday. And then I also have James Armstrong Band. The James Armstrong Band, I don't have the titles for uh the i'm sorry set list and the same goes for little ed and the blues imperials that one's all done editing though i edited that one a couple weeks ago uh and that's it up currently uploading is jeremiah johnson currently releasing is jr clark harper midwest is done all right so anyway uh i'm done for today see you guys tomorrow I'll be streaming this as much as I can, when I can. So yeah, bye!